my curls dropped. So today we are going to be reviewing the Sailor Moon collection. So my cell phone is in the living room and I have my whole setup set up right now and I can't move, I'm stuck. I'd have to literally like move this table and I have to clear the table off cause it's a hot mess. So um, my phone is over there, but I didn't get everything from the collection. I only, I only didn't, there's only one thing that I did not get and I cannot remember what it is for the life of me. Like I, I can't remember what it was. Um, I'll probably put it down in the description. <laughs> But the, yeah, I pretty much got everything except one thing and it's because I didn't want it and I don't remember what it was. So basically I got the eyeshadow palette, the two blushes, the two body glitters, and two glosses. So I know I'm a little late to the game with this collection. I know it's been out for a while. It was out of stock since last spring and I waited and waited <laughs> until they restocked it I think like three months ago two months ago um, I, I set up for the notification to finally let me know that everything was back in stock so I jumped on the website right away and bought what I wanted um, I meant to put this video up a long time ago because I've had this collection for two months now three months sitting on my table <laughs> and you know life happened a lot of stuff going on you know if you haven't seen my last video you can go to my last video and see what I was talking about but um, pretty much it's just it's been sitting on my desk and I've been wanting to get to it and then the Lizzie McGuire collection dropped and I wanted to get that video out right away so this kind of got put on the back burner but um, I love Sailor Moon I had two dvds not dvds vhs tapes i had two vhs tapes if you know what that is from the dollar store like i don't even know how old i was i think i was like eight years old or something like that and one of them was when the bad guy calls the little children to the boat or something like that and then the other one is like with the ice queen or something like that i don't know what it is but i love sailor moon so i was really 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 excited when i seen that they had a collection for sailor moon and i didn't even know about it this whole time who knew i didn't know where was i all last year you know just enjoying life i don't know but um yeah so this is the look that i came up with um again no thought <laughs> i just kind of winged it and did the best that i could um my buns are for sailor moon i did my best to do some buns up here but you know it doesn't really come out the best it didn't come out the best but i mean hey there's still buns Ooh. yeah still buns so and i curled my hair but the curls dropped <laughs> so anyways but yeah um i have nothing else to say so without further ado if you want to see how i got this look from the sailor moon ColourPop collection then please keep watching I was gonna put press on nails, but I already started filming. Oh well, <laughs> next time. But um, I already did my uh, like foundation and my eyebrows off camera just so that way we can save some time. Um, just like I did with my last review. Okay, so let's jump into the palette. So the packaging is super pretty, like the holographic. Look at that. She's a beauty. We have, of course, Sailor Moon on the cover. Pink, pink's my favorite color. So let's open her up. Oh, ooh. that's so cool. Woo! <laughs> I love that. All right, let's see. The film. Ooh. This palette doesn't have a mirror. Oh well. Oh no. 
one of my shadows chopped up. Oh no. My air conditioning just kicked on, so if you hear that, that's my air conditioning. Damn, that sucks. Oh well, okay. Well, this is the palette. Super pretty. Pretty like peachy, purple, pink colors. There's a yellow in there though. I'm just trying to think. I never know what I'm gonna do. I always just kind of wing it the last second. I never think this through. I'm always just kind of running around the last second. Man, my curls dropped. I'm gonna go in with Twilight Flash and I'm just gonna put that all in my crease. I'll bring you guys in this time. All right, let's go in with that uh, in a fluffy brush. Okay, like a nice orangey color. That brush is too big. There, that's better. All right, I'm gonna go in with Justice and I'm gonna just keep that in the inner corner of my eye. I'm going to go in with this color right here, Moon Castle. I just want to deepen this area up a little bit. I'm going to blend in the color that we went in with first. Next I'm going to go in with Love and I'm going to keep that on the outer corner of my eye. Okay, and that's what we got now. Mm. I need to liven this party up a little bit. I need a little something something. So I think I'm gonna cut the crease. I'm just gonna use Tarte Shape Tape and just lay it on right here. Look up, get my crease going. I'm gonna go in with love and just blend out the ends. Right now we should have something like that. My cut creases are kind of crappy, but I'm practicing. Let's go in with Luna in that cut crease. Be nice to pop some purple in there, let's see. I need to go in with the finer brush, just right here. Okay, I like how this came out so far. Try and bring the crease up a little bit and see how that goes. I was able to hire the cut crease just a little bit. Let's go in with Silver Millennium. I need a little bit more pop in the middle. I'm gonna just put it on my finger and put it in the center and see what happens. Maybe if I use a brush. This shadow is like mushy. Is it supposed to be mushy like this? Is it supposed to be mushy like this? Or did I get like a bad batch or something? Maybe it's meant to be like a highlight or something. I don't know, that's weird. Cause I noticed in the purple shade too, like in the middle of the shadow, it was doing the same thing, but like in the middle. Ooh. I'm gonna go in with the brush and see if that helps. Okay, yeah, so the brush did help. Put it on a little bit more. I really just wanted like a pop for the center. It's so weird. That's like the weirdest eyeshadow I've ever used. Interesting. Huh. 
All right, I'm gonna do the rest of my eye off camera just to save some time and then I'll be back. Okay, so I ended up just like covering that like translucent, iridescent -y white kind of shadow that was on the lid because it just, it looked clumpy and it started like clumping up. So I just covered it with the purple again. Um, so what I wanna do is I'm just going to line my cut crease with the glitter. So I got two of these glitter, they're called glitter, glitter Ollie. <laughs> Glitterally obsessed. Glitterally obsessed. Yeah. And it's just a body glitter. So the first one is called Moonlight Legend. This is what the packaging looks like. Okay. That's cute. And this is basically just a pink glitter. So it comes with the film and then the pink glitter. Okay, and then the next one is called Moon Prince Power. Ooh, this one is a purple. Yeah. So for the sake of the fact that I already put purple here, I think I'm, I feel like if I go in with this purple, it's gonna be too purpley and you're not gonna see it. So I feel like maybe it would just be best if I went in with this pink. Yeah, probably the pink. I'm just gonna take a tiny itty bitty fine brush and grab some of this glitter with it and hope that it's not too chunky and clumpy for me to line. So I'm just gonna line. Oh yeah, it might be. It's, I think it's too, too chunky for me line the top I can already tell this is not gonna be easy I'm just trying to like press it down all right I was able to get it somewhat you see the flakes are kind of chunky so it was hard for me to get it but I got it but that body glitter is like not easy to work with that's that that body glitter was a lot harder for me to work with than the Lizzie McGuire one that was a little bit harder for me. Quickly, I'm just gonna go ahead and conceal my under eye, contour my face, and then um, smoke out my under lash line, and then we'll jump into the blushes. All right, so I went ahead and applied my under eye concealer, did some uh, bronzer, and so now let's jump into the blushes that they have. So there's two blushes, there is cat's eye, and there is from the moon so let's open up cat's eye and see what this looks like this is what the box looks like it has the cat oh how cute that's so cool i love how they did that packaging they didn't put a mirror in the palette but they put a mirror in the blush okay well, this is the blush. This one's called Cat's Eye. And then this one is called From the Moon. We have kind of a peachy one, and then this is just like a straight up like Barbie pink. So these are the two. This one has some shimmer glitter in it, so we'll go in with Cat's Eye. Well, I'm glad there's at least a mirror on the blush, I guess. All right, so I'm just gonna go in with a brush and get into it. And then again, if you always feel like you went in too much with the blush, you just go in with the brush that you went in with your powder foundation on it. Just to tone it down a little bit. Hmm. The blush pigment is like, I don't see it on my finger when I swatch it. Interesting, okay. All right, and I need a highlighter. So I'm gonna go in with uh, Becca in Moonstone. Let me set my face really quick. Oh, 
and I just set my face with my Urban Decay setting spray. This is for the oil control, which I love because it works really well. And now I'm gonna go in. So I'm done with my highlight. Let me pop on some lashes and mascara and I'll be back. Okay, so I popped on some lashes and I just threw on some bottom um, eyeliner because I felt like it needed it, like it needed something, something else. So I just threw on like some bottom liner um, and then just coated my bottom lashes. So last thing we have are the two lip glosses so there's two there's moon tiara and sailor moon so let's open up moon tiara Ooh, okay it's like a pretty peachy color I like that they put the moons on the cap. That's super cute. Okay, and then the next one, Sailor Moon. Let's see. Wait a second. Did I get two of the same color? So this is Sailor Moon. And this is Moon Tiara. Am I tripping or are these the same color? So apparently with all the lighting, this one is actually a pink, like more pink, true pink color. And this is like a coral color. That's crazy. Cause I'm looking at them right now and they look the same. But like when you take them out of all of the lighting, this one is more of like a Barbie pink but lightly like a hint of barbie pink you can barely tell and then this one is like a coral so well let's go ahead and line my lips really quick um i want to go in with moon tiara so i'm just gonna line my lips um i'm going to go in with a lighter liner because i thought there would be a darker gloss but there's not so i'm gonna pick a lighter shade okay i'm gonna go in with kylie one wish liner and I'm just gonna line my lips. Yes, I know, it freaking sucks. I hate that this looks like this, and I hate that. <clears throat> okay. Okay, I line my lips. Now let's go in with the gloss. Oh. The brush is stale. Okay, so the brush is stale. I have to like push it up against the inside of the tube. Ooh, I heard it crunch when I pushed it. Ooh. Okay. Damn. Okay, Sailor Moon. Okay, so that's the gloss. I kind of wish I would have went in with the other one just cause I, I feel like the pinkier look would have looked better, but oh well. You just came on, you're turning on already? My air conditioner has a mind of its own. Just kidding, it's set to auto. <laughs> All right, you guys, this is the final look. What do you think? How did it come out? How do you like the eyeshadow? Did it come out good? I like the gloss. Although the brush was, it was kind of hard to like apply, but I like the gloss. That body glitter was hard to put on my lid, but this is what it looks like. So overall, I would have to say in my opinion, um, about it is the packaging is really really cute 
it's like a collector's item kind of packaging like I wouldn't throw these boxes away I wish that the palette had a mirror in it because I believe all eyeshadow palettes should have mirrors so especially since they put mirrors with the blushes I don't know why they couldn't put a mirror with the palette I feel like it should have a mirror um, that 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 shadow <laughs> that was in here i don't know what it was i don't know if it was supposed to be like a jelly kind of eyeshadow or if it just went bad in the palette i don't know so i'm i'm not sure about that that color millennium i think that's what the color was the body glitter is great it is for what it is for body glitter it was hard for me to put it because because the flakes are so big in the glitter it was hard for me to put it on my lid but I'm guessing it's not for that I'm, it's probably I mean, you would you could probably put this on your collarbone if you go to like festivals and stuff like that so or you could just use it as like a highlight I don't know so but I liked the body glitter um the blushes the pigment on the blush it was kind of hard for me to to use I don't know and then I was swatching it and the color wasn't transferring like onto my finger so if you're gonna use the blush you just really got to get in there with your brush and, and use it the glosses look the same to me they look like the same color I and I'm, I mean one is just like a hint pinker but again I have like all these lights on but they look like the same color to me so I don't know but they're still pretty like I still love the way that this gloss looks on my lip I love the way that the eyeshadow look came out the pigment is um not as uh, <laughs> I can't think of the word the pigment is not as vibrant as the Lizzie McGuire palette was so the pigment I really had to get in there with the pigment but the color selection in the palette I really really like the color selection um, there was one thing I didn't get and it's because I didn't want it I don't remember what it was it was something I don't know what it was but it I didn't want it it's gonna bug me what was it was it a lip scrub? I don't think it was a lip scrub. I don't know what it was. Then I have the palette, the two body glitters, the two shadows, and the two glosses. I'm missing one thing, so I, I don't have my phone on me, so I can't really like say what I what it is I didn't get. But I mean, other than that, like I'm definitely going to keep the packaging and put it on display, because this is cute. Southern Moon's pretty dope. Love Sailor Moon. So, that's pretty much it for this review you guys if you want to get this collection it is back in stock um, on ColourPop's website uh, I know it was out of stock for a minute but it is back in stock so I'm glad I was able to get my hands on it um, before it went out of stock again so yeah that's pretty much it uh, make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed comment down below other content that you would like to see and give this video a big thumbs up and that's it i don't have nothing else to say love you guys bye